Hello and welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our Saving Your Disaster campaign running out of steam. It is indeed an interesting disaster campaign as this one really feels like it has been dragged so deep into the ditches that we're still in the recovery phase. We're lacking supplies, which hopefully the supply rate will uh, solve for us. We just got weapon upgrades. We're kind of still having problems with the roster as the roster isn't really uh, up to date. It's only a set of uh, majors at this point. But yeah, uh, let's level a couple of the low level guys and hopefully that will round up the roster a little bit more. I'm also having my secret plan of getting uh, deep into Asia and getting live fire training, uh, which will help us to get uh, new staff uh, at the rank of a sergeant. And that would definitely save the campaign. But let's not get ahead of ourselves uh, before we can think about live fire training. We we'll actually need to win this mission here. <laughs> Got another XCOM operative. Uh, which is funny because I think at so many missions uh, by now we have had that extra agent. Alright, got a tower there. Getting it done. We want to take the high ground. And let's get the rookie to the front line. Okay, so far that looks decent as a start. Moving up. Lawrence spots out the second tower. And we're continuing to push further into the darkness. Um, On it. Moving up. Double time. Grappling. We're grappling. Just to get the sniper further to the front line. And the Grenadiers... I don't like leaving anyone up in the open, but unfortunately we don't have enough cover. Pushing in, fast and hard. I want to get that um, high ground here. Good. Um, how about we're moving a bit further? And both of our rangers should actually move all the way to here. Good, just double checking that we're not being flanked from the side. And next turn we're going to engage with the uh, turrets. Interesting, okay. This potentially would kill the turret and shred everybody, so I think that's a good start. We don't have Salvo, of course we're too low of a rank. But we kill the turret right away, which in itself is a great achievement. And we saw that there's another pack back here, so don't go in uh, too close. Uh, 
Um, while we're continuing, what's well, our main target, really? <coughs> this is slightly a mind control, which I don't like. Uh, the purifier, I think we need to get them down sooner than later. Don't want to trigger anything, so we potentially need to stand up here. Could move all the way to here, that would not be advisable. Hmm. The other option that we do have is remove all of the cover. But that's at the expense of the second grenade and I don't want to use my grenades that liberally yet. This hopefully is going to kill him. Good. That's important because um, we could have uh, we could have had an incendiary grenade. Shield bearer is just going to use his uh, his shields. So next up, the turret would be the next problematic target. Deflection. Which, thanks to blue screen rounds, should not be a big problem. There we go. Turret. Turret eliminated. Next uh, target is going to be the priest. We are going to. Oh, that would uh, that would be a flanking position. I actually like like that a lot. This would not trigger, but would be a flanking position, so let's go and do that. Kill the priest. Nice little hit. Burning into sustenance, which is great. Shield bearer. Oh, that could have been a crit, but unfortunately it was not. Full cover, overwatch. All right, sustenance stops, but unfortunately burning does not trigger prior to the sustenance. Hmm. We have a stock here. Yes, we did. So that's a hundred percent kill. Enemy down. Very good. Moving to designated coordinates. And that should be another kill. Fabulous. And we got an advanced scope, which is exactly what I was hoping for. <coughs> Alright, triggers another pack. I was hoping that would not be the case, but... Yeah, sometimes you can't prevent that from happening.
Let's try to eliminate the specters. Or at least deal substantial damage to them. Absolutely. We're going into a cover uh, position and I don't want to be seen. So we're using Shadowfall in order to conceal ourselves. Using the rookie as a living mimic beacon. Ah, that's really unfortunate. A lot of dodges, but at least we were hitting. Good, high ground into Overwatch, and that's likely a blazing pinions. Yeah, complete shocker, I know. Ah, uh, complete shocker. <clears throat> Funnily enough, still managed to uh, to get our sniper here. Slowly moving away. Continue to hit that Archon. Of course, the moment that I say that we're no longer hitting. Giving an A protocol to Hattrick, just in case. out of the pinions reload and Madoc uh, yeah, let's just move to here reload and we're good Didn't want to pull yet another pack. On the move. Moving to position. Aye, aye. Sure thing. Good to go. Good. Careful advancement on all fronts. We're using the time to reload. Always reload when you do have the chance, specifically on non-timed missions. You will thank me, because there's nothing worse than running low on ammunition. Move over, move over, move over. Clean blue moves uh, before we're doing anything else. I don't want to go too far yet. Anticipating the next pack, I also would want uh, to have you up here and you down there. 
And whilst we're at it, uh, you up here. Just redistributing uh, the front line a little bit. More high ground, less low ground. All right. Moving up. Okay. Okay. So we're preparing for the worst, which is Overwatch here. Stupid ruler mechanics. That will hurt. I will keep our frostbite for now. Overwatch. Um, should not trigger. Overwatch, okay. Another Overwatch. And this will shred, explode. Come on, execute. Okay, well, the Overwatch strategy did not really work out uh, very well. Okay. That will trigger another action. He's too far away um, to do anything, but he might do Devastate. I unfortunately were, was too far away from um, from freezing him. All right, Frostbite. Very good. Lightning Hands uh, will not reduce the time on him being frozen. But that will reduce the time on him being frozen. Archons are being a problem. Listen, this could be an execute. Unfortunately, it wasn't. This should get him over the hump um, of needing to flee right right yeah i think so summon portal and get out of here nice little crit good job oh no it no i was i was dead wrong okay well that's going to hurt I already know it's going to hurt, so might as well continue giving him our best shot. Told you 
toward you, it's going to hurt. Unfortunately, a few hit points... A few hit points were missing. Damn it. down. Sergio here is going to continue being our Mimic Beacon. Of course, another dodge. Devastate. Yeah, Blazing Pinions. Okay. Takes a shot. No, overwatches, okay. Sergio is down. Good. We might lose her next turn. Absolute mess. They will be able to flank us regardless. Might as well close the distance and try to alpha strike them down with what we have. Burning deal three points of damage? Maybe. Ouch. Burning apparently deals no damage to him. one down listen we can't outrun them might as well reload and deal as much damage as we can Getting close and hit him. <laughs> of course. Okay, oh boy, this is going to be one of those missions. I'm all right. Moving on target location. All right, he's burning. Nice little dodge. Ready to go. I want the supplies. Enemy eliminated. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Wow. So we lost our rookie. That is not a problem. It barely doesn't count, but four soldiers wounded, two soldiers killed, that definitely counts. First soldier got uh, sniped by an Archon from over here. It's only so much I can do. Maximum damage, maximum crit damage, so yeah, it is what it is. And uh, the second was the Sniper with Devastate. Yeah. Because we were one hit point short of um, hitting the threshold. Will stop at nothing. 
could have just been one more overboard shot that was hitting anything would have helped us uh, there upgrade in the sniper rifles would have helped us so yeah lost the sergeant and the squaddy gained uh, two upgrades in return so we got a couple of corporals um, and an advanced scope which is going to be helpful was it worth it? I will let you guys decide. This is definitely turning into a, a bare knuckle brawl. Avenger plotting new course. This is definitely turning into a bare knuckle brawl where there is, the enemy isn't holding back, we're not holding back nothing. No one is holding anything back. Can't upgrade at the moment, we need more uh, supplies and we will get that from here. Fabulous. Some of our people are a little worse for wear after that last covert action, but if we give them time to rest, they'll be fine. We need a re uh, Reaper. Resistance found a way into the chosen stronghold, Commander. Our Skirmisher is leading uh, that and needs some help. Good. There you go. Oh boy. This is definitely one of the more difficult saving your disaster campaigns. Got an engineer here uh, with losts. Stiletto rounds, supplies could be helpful, or a scientist. Hmm. Hmm. Question is, what what do we really need? Supplies wouldn't be bad, because we, funnily enough, need money. So maybe Operation Crypt Child is a go. I would, uh, once we do have the alien alloys and uh, the Alarium crystals, I can sell more um, at the black market. With that money, we can finally get the upgrades that we were looking for. Just give the word and I'll get started, Commander. In terms of weapon upgrades, yeah, we, we would need more of these. And then Warden Armor would be definitely great. Um, I see an opportunity though. Short Black Market visit. And next month with the extra income we should even be able to upgrade the armor and that will definitely increase survivability quite a bit so purifiers yes don't need those and i think we can do the weapon upgrade now what can i do for you commander there we go, plasma weapon. Uh, Balpa needs Moilarium, we don't have that. Okay, so that's not happening. Let me double check. Can we buy something with the intel that we have gathered? Not really. I was hoping for a high level soldier, but all we got is an engineer. I'll save the intel. All right, listen guys, that's the end of today's episode. Next time we're continuing uh, with this crazy run. And I'm going to try to get us uh, some more supplies because that's the way out of this mess.
Uh, plus more Illyrium, plus more Alloys, and then we're going to be good. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy uh, this type of content, leave a comment and a like down below, and see you on the next episode. Bye-bye.